Hello the kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only. Coming to you with another episode of Borderlands. Alright, when we left off, we were in the middle of dealing with stuff around here. Don't know why I'm walking. <laughs> and I figured I'd check the little shop area before I start going on with the final mission in the Trash Coast, which is the main mission in the Trash Coast. Well, the main story mission, anyway. Anyway, I'm going to try and see what I should grab. I need a lot of revolver ammo, that's for damn sure. Look at all of that. I need, goddamn. I uh, could probably use some combat rifle ammo, too. Probably. And that should do. Alright. Uh, nah, I'm good. <laughs> I was thinking maybe one more revolver, but now nah, I'm good. Alright. <sighs> now, we are heading on to the last story mission within this area. Well, the only story mission within this area. The last mission total in this area, as far as I'm aware. So... Onwards we go to overcome the challenge. Doesn't mention what it is, so here goes something. Alright. There's a bit of ammo over here from the looks of it. A bit of ammo. Thank you. I'll take that. So not as much as I was hoping for. Less than you'd think, but more than you'd hope. Okay. Oh, I hear something. I hear something that's disturbing, and a little ammo or whatever the heck in the middle of this thing. It's flashing purple and some... Yeah, there we go. Like that. And some spots it's not. It's weird. Anyway. Oh, there's a spider ant. And bam. I definitely love doing that. And we got one of them. Yep. Probably going to be all of them I get. And... Bye. There we go. <laughs> Nailed it! Uh oh. It's, I have a feeling that's gonna be a special one. Nope, not really. Soldier and King. <laughs> Killed the King before the Soldier. How's that work? Oh, Jesus! Oh, Jesus! Oh, Jesus! Target! Okay. Okay. Here. Well, if we are, then I'm winning. That's for damn sure. Oh boy. I love this gun. Although I've run through ammo like a motherfucker with it. Holy shit. Okay. I think I just wasted like 200 rounds? 300? In that engagement alone? Alright, I'm gonna run to the revolver real quick. Keep me, you know, somewhat... What's the word I'm looking for? Uh... Sparing with my ammo. My ammunition. Yeah, that's a weird pronunciation of it. Why did I go that route? I don't know. <sighs> Sometimes I just say things to see what sticks. Sometimes it works. Sometimes it doesn't. This is one of those times. Of the latter, not the former. Okay. Oh, Jesus. This looks like an ugly motherfucker, and it is. Disgusting fart gas coming out of its mouth is like really grody. Back high. Yay! It moves and is living. Fantastic. I'm gonna die. That's what I'm getting out of this engagement here. Alright. Got racks. Yippee. But that's not what I want at all. Okay, they explode. Great. I've already damaged it to about a third of its health. Kind of impressive considering that is fucking up the frame rate. Holy shit. And that will probably be nauseous gas for like forever. I might as well run through it. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna get the damage. Oh, jeez. Ah! Oh, jeez. 
more explosions. Explosive ones. I'm just gonna throw that. See what this does. Open it to hold something good for my future. Okay, apparently not. What? Oh, really? Oh, that's. That's a different kind of thing. Okay, hopefully this continues to be useful. Oh, I got one eye out. Something. Thing. Jesus. I did not think that was possible, but I didn't. Hey! Destroyed the hive. That was a lot easier than I thought it'd be. To be perfectly honest. And you are dead as dicks. Holy shit. And you're still twitching. Uh weird ass I'm not gonna say it. <laughs> It's very apparent what that looks like. I'm not going to have to say it. And if you're able to tell, congrats, you are 12. Okay. There we are. <laughs> I'm just gonna take all of that. There's nothing here. Damn it. Did it drop anything useful for me? <laughs> There's so much ammo over here. Expecting that I'm gonna run through it, not expecting that I'm gonna be like 32 in a 20 or 28 level fight. I assume that he was 28 or 29 because I didn't really look at the number next to his name. I was just going, Holy shit, that's a huge bitch. Okay, I think I just collected everything. Oh, didn't realize the side exploded like that. Yeah, 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 you're, you're pretty dead. Oh, this is all the loot. Okay, cool. There we go. Uh, we got that, which is kind of worth something. That's more worth something. That's kind of something. Don't need those at all. What the? Okay. All right. That's a blast revolver. Kind of worth something. Cash and... Is that it? Is that all that was here? Just this? Well, I'm not going to complain because, you know... At least, that's the most I'm going to have to deal with, currently. Hopefully. I hope we don't have to deal with another one. Because that was stressful enough just dealing with the other one. Okay. I'm going to have this out just on the off chance. No, I'm going to go over my revolver. This tried and true method of deterrence. Not outright murder. Okay. Where in the hell am I supposed to be going? I don't know. At all. Oh, there's something over here, so at least this is kind of a path. I don't know that. What am I supposed to be doing? I am completely in the wrong direction. That's what I'm doing. I'm supposed to be in a cave somewhere by the look of it. Which is... Where's that? That's the question. Don't tell me it's that one thing over here that looks gross and grody. Yeah, it's this one thing that looks gross and grody. Okay. Well then, I guess... Holy shit balls! The fuck? Oh, jeez. Okay, what the hell is this? Alright then. It's not attacking me, so at least there's that. Okay. I guess we go forward then. Okay. Got more of these walking around. Oh, ew. What was that? It only fades into view in a certain angle. Yeah, That's gross. That looks very gross. Okay, I guess I gotta go, uh, get this thing then. Oh, this is a shrine to, like, some sort of Beelzebub-like deity in here? Let's see what we got. Ooh, we got a bunch of cash. And the vault key piece. Hey, hey. Alrighty. Got to turn it in where, exactly? That's the question. What we got to turn it into? Oh, I got to go all the way back. Okay. Well, at least now I know. Got to go all the way back. Be able to turn this into wherever the fuck. Yeah. <laughs> that thing's dead. That thing is very dead. You can't really survive that sort of open wound. Well, I mean, I guess you 
could if you're that big, but you are not going to survive for long. It's basically what I'm saying. I'm pretty sure all the internal, you know, organs are supposed to stay that way. Pretty sure. Pretty sure that's a, a 101 of biology somewhere. Maybe. Okay. I guess now we're going to go and run back as fast as possible so we don't have to deal with another one of those. Just, you know, on the off chance we have like five of them coming out later. That would be a little less more. <laughs> a little less more. Yeah, that's qualitary commentary. Okay. Just going to run my happy little ass over here. Up. Up. Oh. Great more. Fantastic. Oh, that one's gonna be dealt with. That one's gonna be dealt with in a second. That one's gonna be dealt with in a second. Oh, the gyro didn't really get as much damage as I thought it would. Oh, that hurt! That one's gone, and the other one's gonna be gone. Oh, I thought you were still I thought you were still corroded. Oh jeez. Okay. That one's gonna die. That one's gonna die in a second. There we go. Yeah, that one survived the corrosion. Surprised it did. Surprised any of these are surviving it, to be perfectly honest. Reload, thank you. And where is that stupid place I'm supposed to be getting to? It's a little further on. Also, how did I not run into those earlier? The question I want to ask. Do they just spring up after the rack hive is dead? Is that what goes on? I don't know. I don't fucking understand. I just know that I ran through that area about five minutes ago and they were not there. I'm just gonna. Oh, come on. Let's do the thing. Thank you for doing the thing. Don't and sell get this. This. And that. And that. Yeah, that one's worthless to me. Sell that. And we're good. Wanna see? We got when you got my machines in there, scary anything needles. special here for shields. I doubt it. Definitely don't need these. Uh, heavy gunner, definitely not. Hmm. Yeah, I think we're good. I think we're good. We don't need any more in that regard. I think we're good. So, time to get out of here. Don't know where the next place is. I could have probably used that uh, one teleporter. Now that I think about it. Damn it. I'm dumb. I is a dumb. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go backwards and do that then. Yeah, that was my bad. I'm going to take full responsibility for that. <laughs> Oopsie doodle. I could probably look up where I'm supposed to go on the mission log. Uh, Rust Commons West, so. Yeah, that's basically where I'm supposed to be going. Uh, Rust Commons East. That'd be where I'd turn these in. And then Earl's Best Friend. I'm gonna do Earl's Best Friend and complete that first. Which means I gotta go to Earl's Scrapyard. There we go. Crazy Earl's Scrapyard, and that's very important. He didn't go through several maddening experiences just to be called Earl. Thank you very much. Oh, wait, that's just me. <laughs> okay. I should really not make jokes about that. But I do anyway, because why not? I might as well laugh at myself. Okay. Oh, you missed me. I missed you. Okay. There we go. Good enough. Come on. One. Get the other one, maybe. There we go. And we're good. And we got a couple more. Really? How'd I miss you? That's what I want to know. Also, whoops. Adult stick. You're dead. <laughs> Didn't expect you to be dead so fast. God damn. Okay. Now let's head over to Earl and deal with this little thing here that he wants to be done. Oh, that's Scrappy. Hey, Scrappy. What you want? Well, I want to give what you, you your stuff. I guess. Your best friend is freed, so you're all good. Scrappy, he came home. Who's a good boy? Scrappy's a good boy. Did those did those mean bandits scare you? I almost mid rest. 
misread that for a second because I'm busy doing the accent. Thanks for sending them free. He's really a lapsed gag, and those bandits wouldn't even know how to clean up his little scrappy doos. Would they? No, they wouldn't. Um, I'm a little bit concerned. Just a little bit. Okay, thank you. Don't you hurry back. I wasn't planning on it, believe me. Okay, I guess we gotta go to the Rust Cummins East now to get done the other things that I need done. Which was, I think, if I find the teleporter again, I'll find a good spot, which is probably where that mesh, the no, mission, whatever the fuck word I'm trying to say, <laughs> whatever I learned those missions about from, will probably be the one I have to go to. Middle of nowhere. Yep, that's probably the one. At this point, I'm just teleporting everywhere. Whee! Drinking my soda in the loading screen because it helps me focus. And not be insane. Well, it's more insane. Okay. Got some cash. Thank you. I uh, got a light healing kit. Yeah, we didn't even really need that many healing kits that I bought. Honestly, I was expecting more of a fight, so I bought a bunch of them and then didn't need them at all. That was weird, honestly. Okay, let's see what we got here. The bait and switch. Wow, that was even more successful than I'd hoped. I don't know if that's an easier way to keep the bandits under control, but it's sure as hell more fun. Here's your reward for a job well done. Alrighty. May God have mercy upon my enemies, because I won't. That seems awesome. I think I am very happy I did that mission. <laughs> oh my God, that is the best looking gun ever. Okay. Learned out my new digs, eh? Thank you, stranger. I'm out of this cesspit. The hell with these New Haven liberals and their woman in charge. Okay. Now I'm very much not happy I got to better all the time. Hey, level up. Yeah, love that. LB7 nailer, or is that an L87? I can barely tell. <laughs> the 8 and the B look so similar around here. Thwack! Uh, negative recoil reduction. That's probably not the best thing. But that is pretty decent zoom and pretty decent critical hit. It. I would actually like to have that gun on my hunter. Okay. Well, level 33. Might as well pop that level into something decent. Although I don't know what I was going to pop it into. Uh, balls. I think. I think. I should probably dump it into this for defense. So that way I can get quick charge a little more quickly. Then again, stockpile seems like it would be pretty good for, uh, well, many reasons, really. Considering I'm already getting health a little bit from it, from my Scorpio turret, I might as well get some ammo, too. So, I think I'm going to put it there for now. And probably put another point in there because I tend to run through ammo a lot <laughs> when I'm sitting next to my turret. So, yeah, we're going to call that good. See what we got here. You Nothing good. Well, you say that. And got nothing good here. Okay. What else do they do? I'm going to sell... Oh, that's an LB nailer. Okay, I read it right the first time. Okay, and sell the other thing. There we go. Patton, I'm going to put into... Where's a good spot for it? That's the question. Uh... How much ammo does it have? It has six rounds. Okay. That is pretty damn good for a weapon of that accuracy and damage. Fire rate's not that great, but then again, it's not that bad considering it's a revolver. Uh, level is it again? 28. So that's really fucking good. And that's closer to my level. Mm, I don't want to replace the destroyer. This is my baby. At the same time, I've already had to replace the pounder. Yeah. There we go, Bert. Let me look at the pounder again. Uh, I'm gonna put the pounder here. And. 
considering this weapon's not really working out for me as well as as well as I'd hoped. Then again, it doesn't have any ammo, doesn't waste any ammo, and this one does the same sort of ammo, and it's starting to give a little bit less return for the bullets I'm spending on it. Okay. I guess I'll replace it with Patton then. There we go. Let's get a good look at this gun. Oh, that is definitely a look. And I like the silver sheen of all the Atlas weapons. I definitely love that. Is there anything weird about this weapon? That's what I want to find out. Nope, pretty straightforward. Pretty straightforward, pretty accurate. And fire rate seems pretty damn good. So I'm just going to buy a little bit of ammo. There we go. I uh, should probably buy some SMG ammo too. Now I think about it. There we go. Um, yeah, I think I'm pretty much good. I think... I think it's finally hit that time where I gotta sell these two guns. <laughs> Sorry about that, but it was getting towards that time that you were running out of your usefulness. See you in the next life, probably. Hopefully, because you're pretty damn good guns. And I'll probably see a variation of you later on. Anyway. Now that we've said goodbye to our probably best guns that we've had for the last few levels, and we move on to our newer and better guns. And we will continue on in our adventure in the next episode, I think. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more, and click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together, and I will see y'all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat playing games for you.